I wanted to show you my Christmas decorations, but I'm starting with a bowl of um, creme brulee that my neighbor Travis brought over a little while ago. I was uh, very touched by that. And here's my kitchen at 507 Court Street. And in my living room, I have uh, some Christmas stuff that I set out, um, including this bowl of uh, I bought it at Macy's, and they called it um, Decorative Fragrance, Cinnamon Cider. And I want to tell you that you can smell this 30 feet away. And if, uh, if you can't smell it through your computer screen, check your set. I also have my poinsettia from Trader Joe's, and from Thanksgiving dinner, my cousin Rhonda and I, uh, she had each guest pose with her for a photo in front of her Christmas tree and then she ran upstairs, printed out the photos, put them in these frames and they were a uh, part of our place setting. Incredible. I also have um, a picture, uh, this has been around for a while, at least since maybe 99 or 2000, it was a little thing that Doug Renton did uh, when I worked at Ross Roy Communications, and I've always had it out at Christmas time. Poor Doug uh, died of a heart attack when he was 46 years old, a few years back here. And this is my table with my little tree that I bought at Party City. <laughs> um, Susan sent me uh, some uh, Christmas decorations which arrived in the mail today, including these two elves. And then I have my candles going. Um, I got these all at Macy's, the pillars and the tapers. Um, one other thing to show you is this ornament, which came from Denmark, and it's a Georg Jensen ornament um, celebrating Christmas in Greenland. So we have the um, snowman and the hearth inside the igloo. Really beautiful. So I have my place all done up uh, for Christmas, and uh, I also decorate it outside. And the great part about decorating uh, for Christmas in California is that uh, it was 80 degrees today, so it was really tremendous. <laughs>